Hey, what's going on everyone? Good morning, good morning. Happy Friday to everyone out there. And get started here in just a minute. Hope everyone out there is doing good today. Up and uh, have a good mindset. I'll bring you some more goodies today from uh, from the book here. Found another uh, little paragraph here that I think kind of goes in tune with uh, with um, kind of my mindset and the way it's always been. Plus, really, what my mindset is today, or not just today, but every day, and especially with what's going on with uh, you know the coronavirus and stuff like that. So. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to read you uh, this little paragraph here, and then I'll kind of go into, you know, what uh, my idea of it is. So uh, this paragraph here is, it's, it's, uh, it's bring it every day. So it's talking about uh, Chip Kelly, head football coach of the NFL's Philadelphia Eagles, acquired a compelling team motto when he coached the University of Oregon Ducks to unprecedented success win the day this means you should take advantage of the opportunity that each day brings to be the best athlete you can be if you're not getting better you're getting worse is a winning philosophy that must be embraced to reach personal excellence and competitive greatness peak performance is the daily strike zone we are aiming for um i just think that that's huge and i just think more people should try to um try to do that every day i know i know some a lot of us are a lot of us are out there really putting in that work every single day and i know like day like times like now it's tough it's hard because we're in a position to where we're kind of restrained um from doing the things that uh that we like to do as far as like um for instance you know, I have students that like to uh, go to the gym. Well, the gyms are closed. So now they're having to use uh, their living rooms and certain, you know, items, couches to do push-ups push -ups with. And uh, they're having to go running or they're having to ride their bike. They're having to do, they're having to find a way to win the day. You know, they, they can't go to the gym and, and, and do their normal routine with the weights and stuff like that and they don't have the weights really at home so they have to make it happen anyways and um same thing with me here with with everything that's going on uh you know my normal routine uh is not the same right now but i have a new one i have a new routine because the the that's why i'm up right now doing these things it's 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 i gotta win the day you know if i sleep in past a certain time and every day is a different day. I get up at different times and I'm not, I'm not, I don't have a, a routine of what I'm trying to do. You know, I'm not going to win the day. You know, I'm trying to win the day every single day because at the end of the day, I want to be able to put my head on my pillow at night and be like, you know, I did good today. You know, I accomplished a lot. Not like, man, you know, I kind of wasted today. You know, I kind of just... I kind of just played around and just wasted time and there's not you know we don't get time back you know we don't get the time back and for anyone that's out there that's um you know still hasn't got moving forward they're kind of at a standstill uh it's time to get up and win that day win every day because we don't get the time back from the time that we started this this break that we're on right now um i don't get that time back but that's okay because I've been busy since we've been on break. You know, it's as soon as everything happened, we knew that we were going to be shut down. It's it's scrambling time, trying to figure out okay, what what's the new norm? How are we gonna how are we gonna do things? How are we gonna make things happen? How are we gonna push forward? Even though we have this big block, this huge wall in our way that we can't move the way we want to move, we have to find a way to move, and. Um, Again, I'm still I'm I'm still worried about a few people out there, you know, like I I don't really see them. Uh you know, we do the the Zoom uh training calls and I'm used to seeing certain faces and I'm seeing a routine every day. I see the same the same certain faces on these training uh with my team and stuff. But then there's some people I don't see anymore. And so um you know, 
I'm wondering about their routine. I'm wondering about their mindset. I'm wondering about, um, you know, what they're doing every day. Because like I said before, we're all in the same position um, as far as like we're, we're kind of constricted from the things that we that we like to do. Um, so you got to find a way to win the day. And I, and I love this because it, it just goes it just goes with what we're talking, you know, what, what's going on. And let me just read it again to just make sure that you guys, it sticks. Um, you know, Chip Kelly, he was a, the head football coach of Philadelphia Eagles. And when he was the coach of the Oregon Ducks, he had a, 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 a quote of win the day. Again, means you should take advantage of the opportunity that each day brings to be the best athlete you can be. Now we're going to take the athlete out of it, or you can, because a lot of us are athletes and we're still working out doing, you know, our workouts and stuff. But just far as life period, you know, we have to try to find a way to bring the best that we have every single day. Because this is huge right here. If you're not getting better, you're getting worse. If you're not getting better, it says you're getting worse. Is a winning philosophy that must be embraced to reach personal excellence and competitive greatness. You know, um, peak performance is the daily strike zone we are aiming for. So if we're not, if we're not getting better, we're getting, we're getting worse. And, um, I just really believe that. I really believe that. So that's why I'm consistent with my runs and my workouts and, uh, you know, just my, my a new daily routine. And again, trying to feed my mind with this stuff here. And then I have my playlist and, you know, I've been really busy with a lot of things trying to provide you know, my team, my students, uh, and along with everyone else, you know, some value here while I can. And uh, it's really, really helping me. It's just one of those things where I've, I, it's just advice that I've given to other people before. Like when you're down and out, try to bring, it's really hard though, because when you're down and out, you know, it's hard to kind of help, help someone else because you're not really feeling it. You're not feeling good about yourself. But you have to find a way and, and if you can't do it for yourself then do do something nice for someone else help someone else out i i get a lot of um enjoyment of watching other people succeed watching other people do good because the world as it is 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 a place where there's a lot of people hurting and you know it hurts to see other people going through through um through some tough things and a lot of it's self-inflicted, you know, a lot of it's self-inflicted, but a lot of it is just, it's out of your control. And um, besides that, you still have to find a way to win the day. You have to win the day. That's why I'm starting it off with, at 7.30, trying to get in a routine with this. Because uh, I was doing these kind of things, these these kind of videos, like in the middle of the day after my workout and stuff. And it's like, you know, how about we jumpstart people's mornings with stuff like this? Because if you're waking up and you're feeling a little groggy and you're feeling a little sluggish and maybe you didn't sleep well and you know and then and, and then you're just not feeling today and then you, all it takes is for someone to be like, well, just take the day off or why don't you just relax? And then that gives you the excuse to relax and, and take the day off. But we don't have that kind of time to waste because every day is an important day to make things happen. So. Um, just wanted to put that out there for you guys and, and just kind of read you this this uh, paragraph out of this book here because like I said, as I'm flipping through it, um, a lot of it has to do with, you know, it's, it's about athletes, you know, champion's mind, you know, it's an athlete for athletes uh, type of mindset. But you can apply that mindset to everything, everything. And we were on the, for those that caught the uh, Instagram, my coach and I were on Instagram last night, it's a pretty cool feature. You can do an interview uh, on Instagram uh, on the live feed. Um, so we were on the live feed last night and he was asking me uh, some questions about competition and stuff like that. And like, how was I able to do like the things that I was able to do? And a lot of that has to do with when no one's watching, when no one's paying attention, when no one sees the things that I'm doing, I'm working. All those years of just consistent action every day of training, lifting, running, you know, eating right, hydrating right, all paid off. Maybe not right away because my wins didn't come like they like they did later on, but in the beginning that's how it started. You know, I've always someone asked me last night um in a message, you know, have I always been 
did jujitsu give me this discipline? And, and the answer, to be honest, is, is no. I had the discipline is coming from wrestling. I wrestled in high school and I really feel like with when I wrestled in high school, it gave me the discipline that I have now. And it's carried me through all these years to where, you know, it's paying off because I'm able to get up and, and, and do certain things because I'm used to sticking to a routine that I have. It's just always been that way. It's just who I am. It's in the DNA now because of I wrestled in high school and that's where it started. And um, that's where I'm able to accumulate wins and then it becomes bigger wins. And that's where things are going the way they are now for me, at least, you know, up until the break and everything, competition and stuff like that. Business wise, um, health wise, you know, I just turned 45 a couple weeks ago and, um, you know, I feel like I'm in great shape. You know, there's always room for improvement to be in better shape for sure. But uh, I feel like, you know, just years and years and years of winning the day and being having consistent routine and, and action has put me in a place where I'm at now. So um, again, if you're not getting better, you're getting worse. And that's those aren't my words, it's Chip Kelly's words is out of this book here. I just wanted to share that with you. All right, guys, so it's Friday. Um, you know, if your mindset isn't where it should be, get it there and win the day, all right? You guys enjoy your coffee if you're having coffee. If not, you know, whatever you're drinking out there, tea, whatever. Have a great day, and we'll catch you guys next time. Thank you.